welcome to Main Street and Mickey. If this is your first time joining us, welcome. I mean, if you're returning, then you can tell that we have a little bit of a different setup. So I'm super excited that you're all joining us today. My name's Abby. I'm one of the three girls who make up this wonderful channel. I'm usually joined by my mom or my sister, and we just love to talk Disney. So if you like to talk Disney, you've come to the right place. Make sure you hit that like button on this video and hit subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. And if you hit the bell notification, you'll know when we post all of our videos. So let's get started. It's the second day of April. And April's a big month in this house because it's not only my birthday month, but it's my sister's. Yes, my mom decided just to get all the birthdays out in one month. <laughs> I love being born in the month of April because it's the start of spring and hello, the birthstone is a diamond. So, score! And I just love it. I think it's very just curly, which is very me, obviously. <laughs> I am so excited and it just makes me think because every year I would for my birthday, I only want to be one place, Disney World. That can't always happen, but thankfully it has happened, not only for me, but my sister. We got to spend our birthdays at Disney, like on our birthdays. It's not like we even went for a trip to celebrate our birthdays. We celebrated it at Disney on our birthdays, so it was really cool. I got to do mine during my college program and my sister came down a couple weeks later for hers, hers and not only did she get to celebrate her birthday at Disney World, but she ran her first half marathon on her birthday. It was crazy, it was a big day for her. So we just love, there's no more magical place to spend it than Disney. So I decided to celebrate the birthday month. We would give you some birthday ideas to do next time you're celebrating your birthday at Walt Disney World. Number one thing is buttons. Get your, treat yourself to a button because they are free. It's love, love, love those free items and you can't pass up a birthday button because that's how everyone can say happy birthday to you or ha and say happy birthday princess or happy birthday prince or whatever. I love the birthday buttons, it's so cool. We were walking down Sunset Boulevard in Hollywood Studios and this, one of the cast members yelled out to have everyone um, sitting in the little eatery area to sing happy birthday to me so that was kind of cool, awkward but cool. And just things like that, when Annie wore hers, a cast member in one of the first stores coming into Epcot yelled and said, Miss, Miss, come here, there's a phone call for you. And we were like, what? So she goes in and guess who was on the phone? It was Mickey Mouse and he was wishing her happy birthday. It was so, so cool. And it just made her laugh and smile. It was such a fun day, such a fun little memory. I love cast members who make those magical moments. It's amazing. The next one I have, you can also, if you don't want to just get a, the generic Disney one, you can head over to some awesome Etsy shops. I love finding buttons on Etsy shops. I used to make some buttons and sell them, um, but life gets in the way and I just don't have time for that anymore, so I leave that to other creative people and I buy from them. So there's some awesome ones out there that you can check out on Etsy. Another thing to do is treat yourself to a salon day. You can go get your nails done, you can go get your hair cut at Magic Kingdom, that's cool, and then they pixie dust your hair. You could go get your manicure, pedicure, whatever, go get a massage or just relax at one of the Census Spas. That's what I did on my birthday. I went to Census Spa at Grand Floridian and got my nails done and it was so nice, so relaxing. They let you go in a little waiting, quiet room and there are pretzels and M&Ms and that was the best part. <laughs> I'm, an, I'm a simple girl, guys. I'm a simple girl. So that was a lot of fun. It's something, it's, you know, not one of the free things, but it is something that's fun to treat yourself on your Disney vacation during your birthday. Another thing that is relatively new are the Amaretz Pasteri. I pronounced that totally wrong, but oh well. It's the Amaretz Cakes. These are the cutest cakes and they you can order them for any special occasion. And what better special occasion is there than your the day of your birth? There's some geese outside who agree with me. Gracious day. So, <laughs> pastry cakes, they're so cute. I haven't gotten one before, but guys, wait till you see my birthday cake. I am so excited. 
woman who goes to church with us, she is doing my birthday cake. I'm so excited. So, uh, yeah, treat yourself to one of those. The information to do that is on here. And you should definitely treat yourself to that on your birthday celebration at Walt Disney World. Character signatures is another fun way to celebrate your birthday. Or if you're trying to get a birthday gift for somebody else, you do what my best friend did, and she had Tinkerbell sign a really cute little framed piece that had a Tinkerbell like, um, Tinkerbell picture. So she had Tinkerbell sign the frame of the Tinkerbell picture because she knows how much I love Tinkerbell and it was so sweet. It's a great, I like, I treasure that gift so much. And if you're doing it for yourself, then you can or something that reminds you of your birthday and have the characters sign it. It's a fun, fun memory. And finally, photo shoot. I mean, if you're like me, the paparazzi is always after you anyways. You might as well just let them take pictures of you all day. <laughs> Kidding. But seriously, it's so much fun to find a friend or just bring some fun little props that you carry around with you at the parks anyways, like, you know, a lightsaber or this BBA cup. And just take pictures, have a photo, past photographer take pictures of you, have a friend take pictures in like, certain, like special locations. Just have fun, like dress up, wear a crown. <laughs> um, Disney bound, like as your favorite character or something like that. Like, there's professional photographers out there, the PhotoPass ones, and they'll use your phone if you want them to. So again, it's a free thing to do on your birthday. <laughs> I'm always looking for free things to do at Walt Disney World and I try to share them with you all when I find them. So I hope you enjoyed some of these little fun things to do on your birthday the next time you're at next time you celebrate your birthday at Walt Disney World or even your unbirthday because you know every day is our own birthday <laughs> but yes this is our birthday month and we'll bring you some more fun birthday things this week because this week is my birthday April 4th and then we'll bring you some other fun birthday celebrations when we celebrate Annie's 30th birthday oh my goodness she's as old as Hollywood Studios man she's getting up there <laughs> just not nice <laughs> I hope you all <clears throat> I hope you all have a, had a fun time with us today. I hope you come back for more. We bring you lots more videos, especially as I reclaim my